Good morning! It's Monday the 1st of October and so it's the start of a lot of things and I want to, um, I love hearing about what people um, are planning with their reading each week so I thought that I would start to make videos each Monday that talk about my plans for the week ahead in terms of reading when I can. I just wanted to quickly mention that I finished Home Fire by Camilla Shamsey. Holy crap! Holy crap! This this totally blew me away. I read it really fast. It was compelling. It was sad. It was eye-opening. It was wonderful. Highly, highly recommend it. I'm so glad I found it for a dollar and picked it up. Um, it's It gives you an insight into um, Muslim life as a Muslim in Britain and um, it's from four different points of view um, in people that are caught up in family members being involved in the jihadist movement it is really really eye-opening and um, really well done and I love that there is a book about this that is so widely read because I think that it's important for everyone to understand how this is all working so um yeah five stars loved it so I, I finished that earlier this morning when i woke up before all of the monsters got out of bed <laughs> they're not monsters they're lovely um so this starts victober right this is the first week of victober um i'm gonna start off with my book for the first prompt which is Far From The Madding Crowd by Thomas Hardy. I want to try and finish this book this week. Um, I would love to finish this book in a few days, but um, we will see how we go. I've kind of mapped out that I need to read about 80 pages a day to get through it in, in four days. Um, whether I am able to do that, um, we will see, but that's my plan with this one. Um, I also am doing the read along wives and daughters and um, the lovely Victober ladies have set out that we need to read two chapters a day so I just will punch out those first two chapters um, of wives and daughters um, and and do that today and then two chapters each day for the rest of the week um, and then my plan is to finish this one and start Kim by Rudyard Kipling um, I wanted to just um, be able to sort of finish a book and start another one each week. That's the aim. We will see how we go. So that's Victober. Um, I'm also doing Sherlocktober on Steve Donahue's channel um, and he has a series of short stories that he um, has set out for everyone to read um, each week. So um, I picked this up for three bucks. <laughs> a secondhand bookshop it's the complete works and it has all the short stories um, and it's one one a day for five days so we're reading um, the red-headed league as the first one and then tomorrow is the man with the twisted lip and then it is um, the adventure of the blue carbuncle and then the adventure of the speckled band and then the adventure of the copper beaches so there's five short stories to read this week for sure october i started um the red-headed league which is the short story for today i've never read any of arthur conan doyle's work any sherlock holmes work before and i think <laughs> yeah the the style of writing is is definitely different to this and what i've been reading so far so it's just gonna take um a, a couple of days i think for my brain to start swimming around you know turning around to this style of writing and obviously thomas hardy as well but that's that's the fun of these things huh? you get to do things that you wouldn't normally do so that's my reading designs for the week um that's in amongst four boys being kept busy but um, thank God for screens and movie time, which is on right now. So I get a chance to speak to you and I get a chance to start reading. So um, I'm going to be vlogging for the week and um, yeah, so you'll get to see whether I actually achieve these aims that I set out. And that's a fun exercise too, I think. Um, yeah, so that's all. Wish me luck and I'll speak to you through the week. Bye.